Hello ladies and gents of men, my name is Tevin and welcome back to Five Nights at Warriors. Now, um, two things, I got a new lamp. As you can tell, it's much brighter. It's kind of blinding when I look at it. Number two, I went to the, um, North Carolina Teachers Rally and it was pretty fun. So, other than that, let's get started. No call tonight? There it is. Okay. Hello? Hello, hello. Well, look at that. You're the night. You've done a good job. Thank you. You managed to save the power. Great. So, just keep up the good work you've done. Um, there is something that I maybe should mention. What? The stories around the things that happened seven years ago, well, they, they are in fact, um, true. Well, nobody knows really what happened. But what we know is that on a Monday about seven years ago, Mario and Waluigi went to work. And as you probably have heard somewhere, they went missing, they never came back from work, and they never came out of the factory. And later the same night, Mario and Luigi, they went into the factory to look for them. But the thing is, they never came out either. And people have also mentioned that Mario's uh, girlfriend or some sort, a peach or something, I don't know if that's the correct name. She went in to look for Mario when he went missing. And apparently she was never found either. And after Peach disappeared, someone came up with a rumor of the factory being cursed or something. And they decided to close it off. Um, we have not really any clue on what really happened. Though some witnesses have said that early in the morning on that same day, an unknown person went into the factory. And uh, yeah, nobody really knew who that person was or anything. And the weird thing is, he never came out either. We also had a Wario costume in the back room. You know, for mascot purposes. And the weird thing, uh, that costume actually disappeared on that same day. So we don't really know where it is. So yeah, the factory has a bit of a dark backstory, I guess. But it looks to have a bright future. By the way, have you been... Doing something to the machine in the machinery room? No. I came to work earlier today and the machine was turned off. And as far as we know, these machines are protected with a code of some sort that really only the employees or previous employees know about. You haven't touched that or something, have you? No. Oh well, it's back on again now. So just hang in there and I'll speak to you tomorrow. Okay, um... A back room? There's no back room. You have the machinery, the corridor, the entrances. You have the freezing room, the bathroom, office exit, and control room. There's nothing about a back room. Nothing. So, if a costume went missing in the back room, why not set up a camera to the back room? I mean, that's my that's just my opinion, but... Honestly, why not? And also... No, no, no! Go away! Go away! Okay. Oh, come on. Ah! Oh. Waluigi, stop taking a crap! That Waluigi. Oh. Uh. Also, I want to say before I forget. Um. There's a guy. Not not just guy, but. The. Uh, let me let me get my brain together. Had a big day. 
Where'd you go, Waluigi? Anyways, um, the guy who um put this game up on Game Jolt, as well as the second and third Finite at Warriors, he told me to get the weaker version so that it can run better on my Android. So I actually had to uninstall the Finite at Warriors I had and get the weaker version. And I'm glad I listened to him because the reason why I did it and why I had to is because um, in the last video, my game crashed. No! My game crashed, so I got the weaker version. Uh, fine, just kill me. Uh, are you the actual Wario or just the mascot costume? That's what I want to know. Game over. Is that my head? Am I really bald? Oh. I don't look so good. Ugh. Okay. But I will be providing a link to the guy's channel in the description below for helping me out. And, um... Without him, my game would have kept crashing, so major thank you. I forget what your name is, but I'll find it. Hello, hello, hello. Actually, I, I can go ahead and skip this. I can go ahead and skip this. Let the night begin. And Princess Peach is here with us as well, huh? Wait, wait, there's somebody there. You can't fool me. I saw somebody in the corner right there. You guys can pause it. I know I saw somebody. No, not that. Uh. Also, this lamp I got came from Dollar Tree. It's a sunbeam. And honestly... It should be worth about $20. Hi, Luigi. Because of how good it is. Like, I've even showed you guys the brightness settings. And it's a... Oh, oh, you're coming right here, aren't you? No! Okay, Luigi. Just because you didn't have a girlfriend like Mario... Doesn't mean you can come crying to me about it, okay? Just saying. Just saying. You can take your big, fat Squidward node and just... I, I was about to cuss, but just, you know, chug out of here. What? You know, sometimes I do want to cuss, but then I remember my channel is kid-friendly, so I'm not going to be doing a lot of cussing around here. Thank you for going back to the corridor. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Now, I will probably do tonight and night four. And then save night five for the next video. The next video. I got so many videos I need to be making. You're flying again. And there's that music from Abandoned House, if any of you remember that video I made. Oh, see, I don't like how you don't make a single noise. I don't like that.
Not that. Didn't mean to touch that. 3 a.m. 3 a.m. I just gotta... Gotta keep an eye on him. Oh, he's gone. Okay. Oh, I'm so glad I checked that. Oh. Oh, that would have been a game over. Okay. Alright. Gosh, Waluigi takes a lot of crap. Gross. Get out of here, Waluigi. Hi! Oh. You. Uh. I have a viewer whose channel name is Princess Peach. I'm sure they'll be glad to see you. 4 a.m. Oh, great. I got distracted by the lo lovely Princess Peach right there. I got distracted by the lovely Princess Peach. <laughs> <laughs> Must control my middle fingers. Alright, we'll do this, we'll get this, we'll nail this. <sighs> Waluigi, Waluigi. Also, I'm going to be buying some new backdrop, so. Alright. Alright, well, Luigi is not taking a crap yet, so that's good. Alright. Oh, I haven't yet seen Mario. I've seen Luigi and Princess Peach, as well as Wario and Waluigi, but... Where is Mario? Where is Mario? You know, they should have Yoshi here just for an Easter egg. Just for an Easter egg. Okay. Oh! Freaking door saw me. I was trying to show you guys my brightness setting on my lamp. Because you guys have no idea how awesome it is. Okay. There's... Low, there's dark. That's super bright. And that's the one I was using. Glad I caught you there, Wari. Okay, I'm good. I'm going to beat this night. Either I beat this night or I'm a cry. I'm a cry. Not really, but you know. All right, who's there? Wario, or Wario ma mascot, whatever, whichever one you are, real ma Wario or the suit, or either or. I think you might be the real Wario, but I'm not sure. You may be, but I'm not sure. Okay. Gotcha. You, are you the mascot? That's what I'm wondering. Are you actual Wario or the mascot? Which one of 
few is Wario and which one's the mascot. Ugh. Come on. Come on, bring it. It's 3 a.m. Bring it. I got power. Ah, gotcha. Wait, did he walk off? Okay, good. Good, good, good. Oh, come on. Okay, it's 3 a.m. I'm good. I'm good, bring it on. Is that the best you can do? Hi, Princess Peach. You look even more you than before. Oh, come on. It's kind of... kind of disturbing me that I haven't seen Luigi once. Luigi, you okay? Wario's being more active than Luigi. And yes, I did have to replay this the first night and the second night when I installed the weaker version of this, so... You know, it's 5 a.m. It's 5 a.m. It's time to close shop. It's time to close shop. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. I'm at 75, I can just ride this out. I got enough battery. Please tell me I have enough battery. I have to. I have to have enough. I have to. Come on, night four, 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 night four. Not Fortnite. I'm talking about night four, baby. Come on. Night four. I'm gonna hide under my desk. Not really, but come on, <laughs> come on, 6 a.m. Yes. <laughs> Night four. All right. If this proves to be too hard. I'll break it up into another episode. Hello. I shouldn't worry about these other cameras. Well, all right, you're in position. Mm -hmm. Well, this is your fortnight. Um, I think that you can take tomorrow and the rest of next week off. We at the company here have decided to close the factory off for a little while. Some things has been going on. The machines keep turning on and off, and there seem to constantly be some kind of glitch in the system. And yesterday, an employee found, well, two teeth in the basement. So we have weird things that has been going on. So we decided to close it off, at least for a while. One could think that there are some intruders trying to get the secret recipe. If you didn't know, Wario and Waluigi had a secret recipe that um, I'm sure many people really wanted to have. Apparently they came up with this recipe at an old location. Yeah, apparently Wario and Waluigi ran a little shop or something before this factory was opened. But it should be very hard for any thieves to get into the factory. If you haven't noticed, this factory has two entrances. And both of those entrances are heavily locked, so any intruder getting in should be impossible. And speaking of intruders and people inside a factory, you haven't heard any voices of some kind? Well, as I was leaving my day shifts yesterday, I, I could swear I heard a voice coming from inside a factory. It said something like, stop him and help me or something. I don't know. It's weird though, because it really sounded like that Luigi guy who went missing. 
So anyways, just get through this night, and you will probably have a day off tomorrow. We'll send you a letter in the mail. And keep an eye out for something... unusual. Anyways, good luck, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Anyways, good luck, and I'll talk to you tomorrow again. Okay, why not move back to the old location if all this stuff is happening here? I would just close shop, I would close down the factory, and I would take all of my employees back to Wario and Waluigi's old location and run the shop there. And also, if I'm a security guard, I should have a freaking gun. Or some kind of melee weapon or something. Like a survival knife or... I don't know, pocket knife at least. Oh my gosh, the power. Oh, uh, the power's gonna go by so fast. Ow, I just burped and it hurt my chest. Ow. Well, it's awfully quiet. I think they I think they just want me to know I'm very, very, very limited on power tonight. Come on, 1 a.m. You'd make me feel much more comfortable. Now, I don't know if I mentioned, but the theatrical screening of this game makes it look like the left door is much bigger than it really is. Hello? Yeah, they're going to temporarily, temporarily close shop. Hello? There's something on my computer. Uh, that's, that's, uh, that's new. Uh, uh. Oh, you're getting bigger. Er. Is there a certain camera I look at? That's the original Mario music. It's just more disoriented. How do I get rid of this? <laughs> ah! Sorry. Two jump scares in one. All right. Oh. Okay. I'll just make the fifth one, I'll just make night four and night five happen in one video, so I don't know how to get rid of Mario. I don't, so thank you guys so much for watching, and thank you, the guy who um put the links up to the original Wario games up on Game Jolt. I will provide a link to your channel in the description, so thank you guys so much again for watching. As always, I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye. <laughs>